Okay, so all of our dishware is clean. It's on the dry rack and it's air drying. The three compartment sink is all clean. It is ready for the next tenant to use. The only thing we have to do yet is clean that, take out the garbage. So that includes whatever we put into the garbage can next to the sink. I know it looks like there's hardly anything in there, but there's food. If we leave it, after a couple hours, it starts to grow bacteria. After a couple minutes, it starts to attract flies and other critters. It seems inefficient, but we have to dump it. Everything that you put food in has to go away. So we take our bags, combine all of the things, and we take it out to the bins. Before we do, we take off our apron, and this is our used towels. Used towels go in the hamper right there. If you think about it, sanitizer, give it a little spritz, because flies seem to like that. A little, just a little extra. Okay, we're at the garbage bins. Most, one of the most important things to do around here is always flatten all of your boxes. And I mean totally flat. It's not hard to do. Just step in it, kick it down flat. Don't ever put a complete box in the, in the garbage bins unless it's been flattened. And, the gar and they can go in either bin, green or blue, whichever has the most room in it. The compostable, however, it came out of a black bag that was in the green garbage bin, always goes in the green. The recycle, which is plastic and metal, possibly cardboard and paper, always in the blue bin. Okay, let's go back, put new liners in these things, and we'll be done. Blue ones come from here. The big green one, and then the little one next to the two compartment sink. Okay, our garbage cans are all have new liners. The only thing we have to do is go get our product, package it up, and take it to our clients.